Yo, what's up? It's your man, Tony Sko. Our inbox issue this morning, of course, we were talking about Fox News. At Fox News Politics was allegedly hacked this weekend with uh, messages that the president, Barack Obama, had been shot to death while campaigning in Iowa. We just wanted to know if you thought it was indeed an accident, were they hacked, or is Fox on some BS? Now, I'm going to let you know. Tony used the word BS, but I'm going to use the word bullshit because that's what they... Uh, I find it hard to believe that a major, 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 major news network does not have somebody specifically hired to handle the Twitter situation. And once something like that went out, that it was allowed to stay up for 10 hours. 10 hours. Total disrespect to our president. But a listener said, Kanye West said, George Bush doesn't like black people and call hell for years. But this news network that we go to for credibility and reliable news left a uh, tweet up saying that the president had been shot in Iowa and assassinated over the weekend for 10 hours. That's crazy. Wow. It could have been another shot at the president, but I mean, I'm not too sure about how Twitter manages or administers its uh, security, so I, I, because I don't use Twitter, I wouldn't know what it requires to log in or whatever. Shot at President Obama. <laughs> All right, I reported on Leon's locker room that internet sensation Kimbo Slice was going to be taking his talents to the boxing ring. He's an MMA. Didn't do too great there because once people found out if you got him on the mat, you could beat him, and his stand-up game was null and void. When Island Boxing, there's no taking him to the ground, only if you do it with a severe punch to the jaw. Now, I want to know out there, do you guys think Kimbo Slice can have a great career as a professional boxer. Now, he's 37 years old. The heavyweight division is really light. The Klitschko brothers control it all. The Russians got all the gold on lock. Can Kimbo Slice be a good boxer? I don't know anything about Kimbo Slice. I don't know. Right. I mean, you know, yeah. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. no, that's, you know. I think you don't get his ass. Okay. He ain't do too well in there, man. Right. Yo, what's up? It's your man, Tony Sko. Hit WGCI.com and see the story about my man, you know, the first Bieber, uh, Aaron Carter, who claims in a magazine interview that he received cocaine and wine from the late great king of pop, Michael Jackson. So go and check that story out. And I just want to be the first to say, I, Tony Schofield, never, ever received cocaine or wine from Michael Jackson. But Tito, that mother boy, he had all the damn cocaine, wine, heroin, oxycontin, hydrocortisone, whatever the hell you need, just call Tito. Tito is the one who be getting it on. He's balling, y'all, I'm telling you. No. I don't. 